patients can have confidence in the PMC Lawson Cancer Center from our diagnostic capabilities to advanced genetic testing, clinical trials, and dedicated oncology pharmacy services. Our purpose is saving lives. As Eastern Kentucky has experienced several accidents and disasters over the past few months, Pikeville Medical Center is as prepared as ever to handle any emergency. As the only level two trauma center in the state, they have a great responsibility to save the lives of all who are in their care. Every other department in the hospital relies on emergency services. We are the only level two trauma center in the state of Kentucky, which puts us in a position that we have to be prepared for an influx of patients at any given time. So in the emergency department, we do a staggered staffing model. We have X number of staff come in at a certain time, and then all throughout the day, especially during the busiest parts of the day, we're adding staff, and then as the time dwindles off to the volume starting to taper off, that staff starts tapering off as well. So all departments, our ortho department, uh, med surge floors, all of our departments are looking at how can we improve our process that affects everybody else. If we don't get it right in the emergency department, then it's gonna affect surgery, it's gonna affect ICU, uh, the med surge, the cardiac units, all the other units, even oncology can be affected if we don't do the right thing in the emergency department. Morton says more people are now being admitted to PMC instead of being flown out. This is due to the increase in efficiency and responsiveness of their emergency department. Within the last year, year and a half, you know, we had a bus crash right here in Pike County up towards Shelby Valley that brought like 30 kids in that had been to a track meet. Luckily, all of them were very minor incident. So, uh, you know, using the processes that I've already described here, we got what staff that we needed here, additional to what was already on duty, and we handled the influx, we got them through, we got them treated, and we got them discharged. Back 25, 30 years ago, people would see a helicopter uh, coming in and they're like, oh, well, Pipe will send somebody else out. Well, today that, that helicopter is generally bringing somebody in. Very seldom is it taking somebody out. Uh, we've, we've become the hub for the area where used to everybody was sent to Lexington, Louisville, Cincinnati, Kingsport. Now they're sent to Pipeville Medical Center and very few of them go back out. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.